What is up guys? So today I have here the Samsung Galaxy Z Flip 6 and today I'm going to be talking about One UI 6.1. So let's get started. So first I just want to say One UI 6.1.1, which is what I meant to say earlier, One UI 6.1.1 is definitely super nice. It's a really smooth operating system that has some new AI features and just overall some really nice new features and just overall a really smooth operating system. Um, the first new feature that I'm going to talk about is found within the call or contacts app. And that is your contact poster. So this is what basically is Samsung's version of your contact poster on iPhone. So if you go to edit your profile, you're going to see this new profile card, which is what Samsung's calling it. Um, and then you, if you hit edit, you can, you know, you basically edit a bunch of things with it. Preview. So this is what it's going to look like on the fold, and this is what it's going to look like on a normal phone. So kind of cool there. Um, you can also set up peop other people's profile cards just like you can do on iOS. So it's definitely super nice that you can do that. And then the next new feature is the a new AI. So we have a new section in the settings application called Galaxy AI. So we have a new type of interpreter for Galaxy devices or flip devices that can use the cover screen as a, like, I guess like a viewfinder. Let me show you guys. There you go, that's what it looks like. And then, el habla espanol, el, el otro persona eh, mira en inglés para tu hablo en español. That was horrible. Does the Spanish speak to another person look in English for you speaking in Spanish? That's basically what I said. <laughs> um, yeah, and then we have some improved chat assist. Um, call assist, which has been, you know, expanded to other applications like WhatsApp and some other third-party calling. Browser, same thing, transcript and notes kind of got merged. Drawing assist, which is new, and then health assist, which is also new. Photo uh, ambient wallpaper, which is new for the flip devices. Process data only on device if you want it to be, I guess, more secure technically. Um, yeah, so there are some new AI features. I'll be having a separate video probably coming out Saturday. Um, which will be what today's the 26th so will be the 27th so yeah definitely subscribe if you want to see that and just for like the overall stability of this operating system so it's definitely super nice um we have really um we have it's really nice we have really fluid animations which is super nice to see it's a really responsive some apps aren't really quite optimized for as you saw like the bible app kind of glitched out um but yeah so definitely super nice experience um, looking, taking a look at the health, there is a new health app, which is really nice. We have the, um, whatever this is, the energy score, which, um, directly ties into the new Galaxy Watch 7 series. Um, so that's pretty nice too. Uh, we do have a few new optimized apps, like the weather app is optimized on the cover screen, which is really nice. And then also for the cover screen with One UI 6.1, we have some new, um, widgets. So we have, um... Which ones are new? The sleep score widget is new. We also have a new these this type of widget where you can have different types of widget in one widget, if that makes sense. Like you can pile a bunch of widgets into one, so kind of like I guess like save space or whatever. Obviously new Galaxy Buds 3 Pro widget. And yeah, the weather app has been you can do more things on it and like see more things, which is really nice. Um, yeah, so pretty much that's everything that's new with One UI 6.1. Um, I will be kind of digging more into it to see if there's anything new, and if there is anything that I didn't notice, I'll definitely let you guys know. Um, yeah, th so thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, definitely consider subscribing for the One UI 7 beta update. That should be coming out Monday, so definitely subscribe. I have a lot of videos out on that. Um, yeah, so thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you in my next video, and I'll see you then.